Hey, I'm Melanie C and this is Mix. My new song, Who I Am, is really fun, really danceable, but there's quite a thoughtful lyric. I wanted to make some really fun dance pop music, but I wanted to express emotions. It's about self-acceptance and really loving every part of yourself. I found quarantine quite challenging. I'm kind of up and down. I speak to a lot of people and I think we're having a similar experience. It's been good for me to be home, to be sleeping in my own bed and have lots of time with my daughter. My work often takes me away, so it's quite nice to be at home. Um, but I miss my friends and I miss socialising and travelling and performing to my lovely, lovely fans. So I'm looking forward to when we can all start living life like that again. My day's quite busy as Who I Am is out now. I've still had lots of promotion to do. I've been speaking to lots of people online. I've been doing Q&A and streaming lots for my lovely fans out there and I've done some DJ sets and we're planning to have a performance go online as well. I suppose it's just kind of compounded what I knew. Um, although I love being at home, I do love to travel and I'm missing that and I really don't like housework. I love being Sporty Spice and I embrace her more now than ever. You know, I never, I've never really seen the Spice Girls era as ending. I feel like it's just kind of changed and evolved. You know, obviously back in the day, in the 90s, when we were at the height of our fame, it was just an incredible ride, like a childhood fantasy. And then embarking on my solo career, you know, the, the, the band for me took a little bit of a backseat. And then doing some stadium shows in the UK last year, 2019, was really wonderful because it enabled me to really revisit myself as Sporty Spice. And it made me realise that, you know, Sporty Spice is a huge part of who I am in everyday life, you know, whether I'm being a Spice Girl, a mum, a solo artist. So I really, you know, enjoy and embrace that aspect of my life. I suppose I'm a pretty decent cook, um, people might not know that, and I can sew a little bit, <laughs> but nothing is an extreme talent. I've been listening to lots of different music through quarantine. Um, Dua Lipa dropped her new album at the beginning of quarantine and I love that. I love the songs, I love the style, I love the production, I love her. So that's really cool. I also had the opportunity to chat to um, a young, a new artist who's releasing her first album, um, Rina Sawayama. She is a British Japanese girl and her music's really eclectic. It's pop music, but she has lots of influences from like 90s R&B to even like new metal and uh, she's got a great attitude she's full of girl power so she's one of my new favorites as well I'm definitely the quietest Spice Girl I think between me and Victoria we are the quietest so Sporty and Posh are the quieter ones and between Jerry and Melanie I think Melanie probably wins as the loudest Spice Girl I think you'd all agree that I don't actually sing in the shower, very, very rarely. As usual, I've been trying to mix things up, so I'll do some yoga. I will do um, some cycling. I can't run at the moment. I've got a little bit of a hip injury. Um, so yeah, between my cycling, my yoga, trying to do some strength work as well, and um, keep those sporty muscles going. Um, so yeah, they're my kind of usual things. I do love to run, I also love to swim. And I love triathlon. Um, that is my favorite sport to compete in. My advice to everybody, you know, I think this moment in time has really made us more aware of how important it is to be healthy. Um, you know, COVID-19 is a horrible virus that has taken so many lives. And, you know, all of the reports, all that we know about it is that, you know, if you are healthy, you have a much better chance of survival if you are to pick up this horrible thing. So I think, 
the most important thing in life is to be happy and to be healthy and we need to do that with balance you know we need to eat well we need to exercise we need to try and get enough sleep not get too stressed and just be kind to ourselves you know we deserve treats we deserve to have cake and chocolate and a glass of wine here and there so it's just really about trying to enjoy your life thank you i hope to see you all very soon